enhance, support, and partner. Those are just three words that describe It's a Breast Thing, an amazing nonprofit that we are so lucky to have in our area. And they are clearly creative with their fundraisers, as you can see on the table. And joining me right now to talk all about it are Susie and Barb. Welcome into Studio 10. Thank you Thank for you having us. us. We're so excited <laughs> to get talking about what we're seeing here on this table and, of course, the amazing work that you do in our community. You've been, this fall fundraiser has been going on for 16 yes, years. When you, yeah. when you hear the word 16 or you look back in the pictures, how does that make you feel knowing that you've been making an impact in our community for that long? It makes us feel great yeah. that we have been able to be supportive of local breast cancer patients. We've um, widened our area that we help people in. Um, it's, it's great. I mean, we've awarded 702 grants to date which is wonderful. Yep. I mean, it just makes us feel great that we're able to do what we do. Mm -hmm. And have it grow every yes, year. Yes, absolutely. You know? Every year is, it grows a little bit more. It extan expands yes. so that way more people can be impacted and helped, as yes. you mentioned. Yeah. And, you know, one of the fun ways that you are able to help are through your fall fundraisers, which have to do with bra decorating, as we can see. Uh, but there's a specific and special bra, uh, this one right here. What makes this one so special that you kind of, it's, it's like a, I don't say like a mascot for her. it's a breast thing, but kind, kind of. of. Yeah. Kind of is. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. This travels to um, all uh, events that we do that we have it's a breast thing there to let them know who we are and what we do and this one has the logo on it it has all the information basically that if somebody really looked at it they would see that there was information on it so this is just one of course of many decorated bras that are on this table and this all has to do with the uh, event that's happening on October 1st right. the theme this year is superheroes and villains right? Right. right talk a little bit about what we can expect coming up on October 1st the, the the amount of creativity in this town is just amazing. It is. Um, these are from past years. Mm -hmm. And these are in the contest this year. Yes, so people are able to uh, sign up to decorate bras and then yes. the community are able to vote on them. Is that how it works? Absolutely. Right. Yeah, absolutely. And the and people who decorate the bras will collect votes before the event as well. They do a lot of pre vote collecting <laughs> to try to get themselves into the top 12 so that they can be in the calendar for the upcoming year where we have survivors that model them. Wow. Yeah. And it's a dollar it's a great. vote. This is the fun part of it. <laughs> The rest of the event is about learning mm -hmm. and about understanding, um, you know, why certain procedures are done and, and, you know, all of those questions that people have, the audience can get involved mm -hmm. in asking questions to the docs. Mm -hmm. And we have different doctors every year coming in to talk. So we have different subjects for the education every year. Oh. So it's not just this. Mm -hmm. It's about, you know, what people learn. Mm -hmm. I've had you know, um, a breast cancer patient come to me afterwards and would say, I was just diagnosed with that, now I understand it. Mm -hmm. Because you get told something, right. but you don't hear it. Mm -hmm. And so sitting there listening to what she was just told, and they talked about it, she now had a f better understanding of what she was just diagnosed with. Yeah. You know, if the community does want to stop by and support, uh, of course, on October 1st, what is the best way that they're able to get involved with this great educational, uh, but also entertaining <laughs> event as well? <laughs> well, the event is October 1st. Mm -hmm. It's out at Eagle Eye. Mm -hmm. Starts at 4.30, goes to 8. Um, there's beverages, there's refreshments, um, and education. All of our models, all these years, mm -hmm. are all breast cancer survivors and they're of all ages, mm -hmm. and uh, they model these bras, mm -hmm. and um, I make the bottom half of the costumes to mm -hmm. finish out their, uh, their costume mm -hmm. of this. And um, it's amazing, the years we've been doing this, that they all come together as strangers and by the time they leave, they're all good friends. Well, I'm so glad that yes. you're able to make an impact on both the survivors, current patients, yes. as well as the community. And of course, you guys at home can be a part of this too. Uh, so the information that's on your screen, you can be a part of the October 1st event. And then also you can find more information how you can order these calendars and just support this amazing cause. Thank you so much for everything. Thank, Thank you, you for so much for having you. us. Yes. yes.